tree. Hi, it's your girl the Wonder May, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new, then hi, it's May. I post random videos about random things on YouTube. Yeah, that's basically everything. Well, you know things change, and I have new hobbies, and also I have two little BTS baby doll. Yay! Well, this is Suga. Meet Subi, Sogi, yay! And this is Peta Jimmy, Peta Jimmy. And because he's my doll, so his name is Jimmy. Well, then if you have two little baby dolls or more, then you would like to make something for them, like a bed or a room or clothes. Then today I'll help you to make these dolls, a little bed. Okay. And uh, before we go, then I would like to thank you so much if you give this video a big thumbs up or subscribe to my channel or comment anything you want me to help you on the comment section down below. The ingredients I will put in the description box and also where to buy them. Okay, let's go! Okay, first we need some spelula, a paper cutter, a scissors, cellulose tape, glue gun, ruler, and a pencil. Okay, first we spread out the spelula. And then you measure your bed with the doll. Here we have a 15 centimeters height petit jimmy. Here we go. He's small. Goodbye. This is a previous bed that I've made. Well, then, Subi, he didn't fit. He's too big. So let's make the bed bigger this time. Okay, let's add one more stick. And here we are. Just right. Okay, let's begin. Okay, so first of all, you want to measure your stick and then cut off the two round edges of the stick. You can easily cut it with your scissors. Repeat with the others. After you finish cutting, use a ruler to place your bed in order. Use a cellulose tape to help you with that. Place a ruler on it and then tape them together. Now we need six more sticks to help keep your bed together. Place your sticks close to the edges of the bed. Put one across the bed like this. Continue place sticks to the empty part. As you can see, the sticks are too long, then you mark the spot and then cut off the extras. Use a glue gun and glue all of them together. Voila! And now the bed is strong enough for your doll to lie on. People would remove the tape, but I won't. I'm just gonna keep it there. It will help me when I glue. And for
for the border of the bed, we use three sticks. Take out two of them. These will be the first two legs of the bed. Measure the height of your bed. Make a square between the panel and the legs. Now use a pencil to mark the spot where you will glue them. Cut the third stick in half. When you glue, remember to turn the round edges up. Like this. What's up glue gun? We meet again. This is how the border would look like after you glue. Now let's continue with the other legs. And before gluing, don't forget to measure the height of the bed. Mark the spot with your pencil where you're gonna glue. the bed after you glue four legs. You can glue the inside too, just to make sure the legs won't fall off. Now let's move on to the side of a bed. We will make the bed look stronger. Here we have a stick, and again, you will want to cut off two round edges. We will need two sticks to fill up each side of a bed. second stick is, of course, longer than the bed. We just need to cut off the extras. Glue them together with a glue gun. This is how it turns out. Now repeat with the other side. The bed looks so much stronger now. And we continue with the ending of the bed. You can definitely leave it like this, but I prefer decoration. It's up to you. Okay, here it is. Finally, the heading of the bed. I'm gonna make a bookshelf on the head of the bed. So, we need supporter. Cut a stick in half and then glue it to the side of the bed like this. This is how it turns out. Use two sticks. Remember to cut off its edges and then glue it inside like this. Here we go, we have a bookshelf. <laughs> 